hello hello cancers welcome back to queen cancer tarot channel everybody i am the host my name is Catherine. i'm here to bring you clarity guidance and love messages i have timeless readings for all of our lovely cancers sun moon rising and venus signs this is a general love reading so please take this energy how it resonates with your energy and with the person that is closest to you if you are new to the channel make sure you are subscribed by clicking on the watermark in the bottom right corner of your screen that will allow your energy to flow freely through this message and through all the messages that i bring on this channel if you are new make sure you are subscribed and entered in your chance to win because i do a giveaway every month on this channel i will be announcing the winners shortly here for the month of june but you will find that information and everything you need to know about claiming your prize in the description box below um, you do not need to purchase anything on my channel in order to win. All you need to do is be subscribed. However, if you would like to request a personal reading with me one-on-one, -on -one, please make sure you reach out to me via email and that information is also in the description box below. I have another channel, you guys, Tarot Talk Live, where I am going to be going live and doing live discussions on various, various topics, including tarot. Um, tarot is just one of the main topics that we focus on, and we will incorporate live readings on that channel, um, which is why thus it's called Tarot Talk Live, and I'm hosting the channel, a tarot reader, um, but we will be having guests on that channel, um, various guests, where we will be having some live discussions and some panels. Um, panel group discussions where you guys will get a chance to come up on stage and you know speak your voice and give your opinion answer questions ask questions um, whatever it is commentary anything that you um, want to do is going to be offered on that channel we're gonna have a lot of fun we're gonna play a lot of games we're gonna have a lot of lives where I do free question readings I'm gonna be taking $20 question readings um, on lives cancer so it's just gonna be a lot of different things going on so please subscribe to the channel there is a poll going on right now where we're voting on what you guys are wanting to watch first and I've already but I feel like it's gonna be dreams you guys I have to break the tie and it's gonna be dreams how to interpret dreams what they mean um, different dreams that people have all different types of things we'll be talking about dreams for the next week on that channel as a main topic um, that'll be like the main overall you know subject that we'll be covering for the following week okay and every week it'll be a different subject that we cover on that channel so go over there and watch the first um, video that's uploaded it'll tell you all about what this channel is going to be about it is um, worth your your while and uh, make sure you subscribe here okay so let's get back to the reading this is part two so cancers we're going to look at your energy i'm going to go ahead and um, get right into it cancer we'll pull some oracle at the end okay but let's let's look at your energy here let's look at your energy here i'm going to go ahead and pull some more oracle messages for your side cancer we we looked at oracle for your person's side so so we have you and i were too young and i'm starting to understand our connection Okay, so there's an energy cancer of, you know, you may feel as though this person just wasn't ready. You weren't ready. This person wasn't ready. You were both at a place where you were very immature. Um, and I feel like you're starting or in, this is in the past now. So I feel like in the past, you were really starting to understand or realize that this person just was not ready for you. And that it was not time for you to be in a real committed relationship anyways. And you just wanted to go and find yourself and be single. So you let this person go. Okay. Yes, you were upset with this person. You were angry. Um, but you let this person go and you went off on your own. 
business here. That's what I'm picking up on. Tell me about cancer, please. Tell me about cancer, Holy Spirit. And we have, I left you before you could leave me, and my life is not as together as it seems. So like I said, Cancer, like you just kind of walked away from this person before it got really ugly. You saw that this person was not really knowing where they were, what they wanted, who they wanted. They were still finding themselves. And you were mature enough, I feel like, to realize that. But you also, Cancer, with my life is not as together as it seems, you also weren't really ready to settle down either. So I feel like when this person comes back in, Cancer, you may just stop this person and say, you know, you know, it was fun and everything. And yes, I did care about you. And yes, you pissed me off. But I really don't think that either one of us is ready for a connection or maybe you are. And I'm sorry, but I, I think I took that time, you know, after I, I left and you left to really realize that I'm just not really ready to settle down right now. So I feel like you are actually going to slow this person down, Cancer. That's why I was getting like a pushback on your part or it's like this person is coming in hot, but then they're having to, to retract and I wasn't really getting it, but now I'm getting it. Tell me about cancer, please. Holy Spirit, angels and guides. Tell me about cancer. Holy Spirit, angels and guides. Tell me about cancer, please. Okay. And we have, I will wait for a sign from you. And you were the best thing in my life. I really do feel the energy of cancer. You really do care about this person but you it's not time you feel like this person is just not ready yet you feel like this person just hasn't really lived out their youth they haven't sowed the seeds that they need to sow i feel like you're wise enough to realize this and you're letting this person know you know once i feel like you're ready then you know i'll i'll let you know because i really do care about you under the deck, I left when I saw you with someone. I feel you leaving me behind and finding out the truth crushed me. But we also have, I'm so attracted to you. So I do, I feel like Cancer, you really do care about this person. You feel a, a level of attraction for this person, but you know, it really hurt you when you saw this person in this energy of not being satisfied with just one person and you realize this and before things got ugly you were mature enough to back off cancer so this is one of those cases where it's like you know you're growing and ascending and this could be your karmic soul mate this could be a karmic soul tie which is difficult where it's like you know you're you ascend and then your person comes here they don't quite meet where you are you ascend some more you know your person comes and it's like at some point they're going to meet up with you cancer but it's like they're not right now that's all and that's all you're trying to let this person know so let's go ahead and look at the energy on your side with the tarot here tell me about cancer please holy spirit angels and guides tell me about cancer please holy spirit angels and guides tell me about cancer holy spirit angels So we have the Eight of Wands and Justice, Aries, Sag, Leo, Libra energy. And I'm probably going to take this into a part three because I'm running out of space here. So if this cuts off, it's going to go into a part three, Cancers, okay? And we have the Nine of Pentacles, Pre-Empress energy, and the Five of Swords in the reverse, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. And then we have the Two of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and the Queen of Swords in the reverse, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Underneath the deck, we have the World, Judgment, and the Lovers, and the Seven of Wands. 
definitely what is happening with you right now, Cancer. Definitely what is happening. So I feel like we are going to take this into a part three, you guys. Um, we're going to free up some space here just before we lose it. And then I will come back and clarify this energy here. Um, but definitely, Cancer, with the world in judgment, like you are... You found some some closure for right now. You're you're closing out this cycle um, because you're feeling like this person isn't ready. With the judgment card, you have evaluated things. You've taken some time to look back and see that you know you're just not ready. With the lovers and the seven of wands, there's an energy of you standing your ground with this person and letting them know like I care about you. There's a connection here, but there's definitely something. With the divine, it is not our time yet. It is just not timing. Okay, so we're going to come back and look at this energy and see what's going on here. Um, and we'll clarify all of this cancer. Look at some more Oracle in part three. I love you guys and I will see you in the part three. Coming up soon. Bye.